and um, yesterday I was trying to do some posts but um, I was having some uh, webcam problems and um, it got really late and I had no light and so I finally gave up but um, I decided since it got too long yesterday I'm gonna go ahead and do the phases but I'm gonna do them all individual and um, from here if you already know about the phases, you can just go ahead and skip these topics. But um, for most people that are just starting, they might want a little bit more detail on it. So um, that's what I'm going to uh, cover. So uh, as far as uh, the phases go, there's four four phases altogether. Uh, the very first phase is what uh, we'll cover today. That one is loading. And... Um, it's called phase one. It only lasts two days. When you start, you start um, in the morning. First thing you do is uh, go to the restroom and then weigh yourself and uh, write that down. And then uh, you, from the moment you get up and you, uh, you eat a lot all day long through the night till you go to bed, you eat uh, high fat, high calorie, sweet, anything uh, food-wise that uh, you can handle and keep yourself full all day long. Um, you would also uh, drink three quarters to a gallon of water that day, uh, both days, separately, so a gallon each day. And um, you take your drops uh, in the morning and then um, 15 minutes prior to eating lunch and 15 minutes prior to eating dinner and then um, even when you're full they even encourage you to, to take have some ice cream before you go to bed and stuff like that so um, it kind of sounds like a, a novel idea at first but when you eat like that you don't feel so great afterwards um, but uh, the loading part is really important to do properly so you are supposed to gain a little bit of weight and um, the first time I did it, I kind of, I kind of followed it, but it wasn't. Uh, I didn't do really well with it. First of all, I was um, packing things for a move, and I got disrupted and moved out of the house a couple times by people that wanted to see our house, and I had to pick up all the stuff and move it out. And I think I, I got a little bit too much exercise during loading, and uh, not enough eating, and. Um, I did, however, go and uh, I had in and out only because I thought perhaps we would be moving right away. We, kn we didn't know if somebody would buy the house right away, so uh, as it turns out, they didn't. But um, And I had uh, a sushi at my favorite sushi place because I knew I was going to miss that. And um, uh, I, I think I did have some uh, blended coffee and things like that. Uh, maybe I had some ice cream one of those days. I don't know, but that's probably my more favorite thing to do. And I, it's possible that I made some cookies too. <laughs> Either way, but uh, I don't quite remember. It's been a little while since my first time I loaded. I, I didn't do it as well as I probably could have. As I know that I did gain three pounds during that first loading and I lost it right away. But um, when you uh, load, you're going to feel full all the time, and pretty soon you're just not going to want to eat any kind of fast food or anything. And uh, then you will, the following morning after your fir first two days of loading, you will go down to um, phase two. And uh, actually, I do recommend um, two things. When you start doing the diet, I need to eat a lot of water in, and one of the uh, vloggers that I uh, watch videos for has mentioned that um, getting three quarters to uh, a gallon of water in a day, um, this was a good tip of filling up a quart mason jars, and um, I do, I think I packed them, but I have some white plastic lids that come there over in the canning section of, um, I don't know, I did see them at Walmart, but uh, you can get them at um, a lot of stores and you just, they're 
they're plastic screw lids that you can put on top so that when you have jam or whatever in your jars you can close them up and keep them in the refrigerator so um, if you fill it up with water uh, and put four of them in the refrigerator to keep cold then you know how much water you've had for the day and that's a really good tip because you really need to get that water it's really important that you drink all your water that you can and um, the other thing was um, uh, um, oh and uh, I'm sorry going uh, I didn't get any sleep last night um, was getting uh, your grocery list ready when during those two days and if you can squeeze it in um, try to get your your fruits and vegetables and protein and everything that you need for phase two when I cover that and um, you'll be able to find both the list for all of these online um, if you'd like to look it over um, before you go ahead with the plan um, but if you do order the drops the uh, little book will come with it and um, it gives you the the list of um, foods that you can eat and um, recipes and things that I had mentioned before so that that particular book will come to you and uh, another tip too is if you um, are a female and you do have are you're still having your uh, time of the month your period you might want to wait until you're done with your period um, immediately after to start because a lot of people have uh, fluctuations during that time and um, um, I just it might be easier for you to wait until it's done to do it but um, it, it's uh, you read over in the book and see what you think um, but I think that's about it for uh, loading so I'll cover phase two next <laughs>